to cover a series of outreach actions to the California business community in Orange County and to the Moroccan American community in Los Angeles. We flew from Washington DC to Long Beach, California with the Moroccan ambassador, Mr. Aziz Mekwar. Adil Naji from Arabisk Inc. organized the trip, scheduled the meetings, coordinated with the Irvine Chamber of Commerce and with the Moroccan American Association of Southern California. And producer, writer, cameraman, and jack of all trades, Mustafa Sout from Morocco Board TV. At the City of Irvine Chamber of Commerce presentation, the ambassador was introduced by San Kadbi, the CEO of FTR International, a global contracting and engineering firm who sponsored the Chamber's event. Thank you. Thank you. The Moroccan Ambassador McQuar spoke about investment opportunities in Morocco and the advantageous conditions provided to foreign investors. He fielded questions from the audience on renewable energies in Morocco and on investment in the health sector. The emergence of retirement facilities from Northern Europeans in Morocco elicited a great interest followed by the related questions on necessary services to the Western retirees that moved to Morocco. Following the presentation, several people inquired about specific projects while the ambassador answered their questions. So intellectual property is one of the main uh, things that we have in Morocco, and that's a big advantage. This is why companies prefer to come to Morocco than go to other countries where... Attracted me the retiree from Northern Europe who come to Morocco. So the quality of the healthcare and the need for privatization is something that I attracted my attention. So I'm going to take a some deep look into that one. The OC Register, a daily publication, interviewed the ambassador after his presentation and reported the following day on the visit as well as the investments in Morocco. To meet with some other people, talk about Morocco and see what the, the opportunities of business are. And do you see any sightseeing while you're here? Or? I'm going to go to the Spectrum and, uh, and of course some sightseeing, seeing <laughs> right. the, the region. Later there was a private tour of the largest open mall in the country, the Irvine Spectrum Mall. Its design was inspired by the Moorish Andalusian architecture. The executive VP of the Irvine Company, the developer of the city of Irvine, explained the process, the challenges, and the choices made during the building of the largest outdoor mall in the country. It is the largest urban master plan community in the world. And it is master planned in the sense that all the acreage is, def is determined by uh, what kind of use, uh, from multifamily to home sales to the office buildings to the apartments to retail. The roads were all laid out. And also, as importantly as not, and some people don't understand, also the open space. The company has dedicated over 40,000 acres of the ranch permanently to open space. So we just didn't plan a community, we also planned yeah. open space and they, they refer to it as planning the whole of the, the donut. The senior architect and designer of the mall spoke of the inspiration behind his choices and what has made it such a success in attracting the large numbers of daily visitors. Moroccan halfway Indian, no it was, look at the horseshoe arches used in Moroccan Nasrid style architecture or Al Moravid style architecture, just look at it. Not A renowned California architect explained the fit between the Moroccan style decor and the California the, the style. The Andalusian flavor and the Moroccan flavor of, uh, of these uh, architecture is, is part of Southern California and actually you would find uh, a lot of theaters, old theaters in Hollywood that have this Moroccan theme and then of course I think Hollywood's always been fascinated by uh, Morocco. We visited a house that was recently built and decorated by a Moroccan artisan 
that traveled all the way from Fez, Morocco. It showcases the potential of Moroccan craftsmanship to be imported in the Californian market. A tour by the owner shed light on the challenges and rewards of undertaking such a project. And we try to make all kinds of combinations with your house. A dinner at the exclusive Shady Canyon Country Club was held in the following evening. The mayor of the city of Irvine, Beth Crom, came to greet the ambassador and spoke of the desire to develop economic relations with Morocco. Thank you, thank you very much. And we have that throughout the entire community, people living side by side, living together, working together, learning from one another. and. Um, and I do think that it's, it's important for us. She was invited, along with the business delegation of Orange County, to come and visit Morocco and prospect for new opportunities. The following day, the delegation drove north on Interstate 5 to Los Angeles, California, where a town hall meeting for the Southern California Moroccan American community was organized and held at the downtown Marriott Hotel. The event room was overflowing and following a brief speech by Mr. McQuar, the attendees lined up to ask various questions. The, the problem which I found, because I'm trying to find the, for the product to export to Morocco, and I want to have somebody to help me, what kind, because I was trying to find the information in the computer. I was wondering if you're aware of any particular incentives for American citizens to invest in real estate in Morocco and, and any, anything regarding policies regarding capital gains. There were inquiries relating the lack of transportation options between Morocco and the U.S. The only flight between New York and Casablanca by the Moroccan airline Ram is a drop in the water and is of no help to both Moroccan Americans or potential visitors. Why can't Morocco make deals with all the airlines and have all those airlines bring people to Morocco? Why is the bridge only Royal Air Maroc and Air Canada in a direct flight? And how can, how can we be a part also of this as Moroccan community to promote? Uh, si on compare la communication d'ici au Maroc, on la trouve la plus chère, peut-être la plus chère du monde. Bon, maintenant vous m'avez parlé, c'est très bien, moi je suis ici l'ambassadeur, mais si vous êtes... Toute la communauté marocaine aux états unis commence à dire « voilà ce qu'on veut, voilà nos idées ». How we can do it is by being united. Being united means that we have to be organized and their association organization. Mr. Of Arabisk Inc. spoke excessively on the benefit of MAC that is currently being organized and its potential of streamlining communication among various Moroccan American communities around the country. The trip ended with a visit to the film set at the Universal Studios in Hollywood to watch a shoot of the popular CSI television series. The delegation was invited by the show producer and a friend of Morocco, Mr. Naren Shankar. The star of this TV show, Mr. William Peterson, greeted the Moroccan delegation and expressed his desire to visit Morocco with his wife. He was promptly invited to come and discover the cinematic potential available in the south of Morocco.